what's up from Phoenix? This might, this might not make any sense to you because I staggered the videos, but I was gone. I haven't actually filmed in like a week. The bus is doing great. Went to Portland, stacked a cord of wood. Well, helped with that. Organized uh, the garage. Played musical chairs with all the furniture. Long story. And uh, now I'm back. So Badge offered to help with the rest of the air conditioning fix install. And so I left Tucson this morning about two hours ago. I'm tired. I didn't sleep enough last night. And we're going back out to the desert. And I got like two plus more hours um, to go. So I'm going to stop in my home away from home and uh, resupply the fridge and freezer. We got raspberries, blueberries, uh, spinach, and that's all gonna be for the shakes. And then we got frozen vegetables for uh, meals. I'm gonna hard boil eggs, and then I have three of those one pound turkeys. And I got a bunch of kefir. These are for Badge, he doesn't like yogurt, but I told him he might like this stuff. Uh, it's kefir, it's an excellent probiotic. This is the uh, Lifeway brand you can get at Walmart. And then sweet potatoes. Sweet potatoes are not yams. Uh, <laughs> these are sweet potatoes. The actual sweet potato is related to carrots. And it is not a yam color. It is like a golden potato color. And then apples and then little storage bins to do my meal preps. Oh, and then I got Badge some McDonald's coffee because that's his favorite. And four waters. We are ready to hit the road. <laughs> Here's the update. We're going about five miles an hour, and I'm watching some uh, Lost LeBlanc, another great channel. Really great dude. Miss you, dude. Totally, totally closed freeway straight ahead. Now we're going to do what the truckers do, and we're just going to hang out in the dirt over here. So when you drive into the dirt, you just kind of watch out for all the bumps. Kind of self-explanatory. And then you just kind of point your thing out the other way. That's it. Well, that didn't last long. That meaning me waiting here. I'm only 45 miles away. This road right here, it goes up six miles and then over on the freeway. So we're going to hop back on the road. Uh oh. Please tell me this is not six miles of traffic right here. If that's the case, I'll be definitely turning around. Yep. You're gonna turn around. Hold on to your britches here. We're back uh, straight ahead across the way. I think you can see it if you are on a laptop or a larger screen closed freeway so I'm just over here <laughs> back where I first pulled off a few minutes ago off to the side is a uh, dairy farm and I can tell you from um, previous experience that thing smells like crap it is bad and nasty especially when the wind is blowing um, I definitely would have been better off back at that truck uh, rest stop but I didn't know <laughs> what I was in for there's actually one not too far away back there, but, you know, I'm a boondocker. I got a toilet, I got water, I got food, so I'm just going to call it a day and just camp here overnight. So, I guess I'm going to start cooking some dinner right now. Well, here's uh, dinner. Traffic is still terrible. 
Uh, just got some ground turkey and then uh, two packages of frozen organic vegetables from Walmart. I'm going to eat half of this and then put the other part of it in the fridge for either later or tomorrow. There we go. Dinner is served. Oh, I almost forgot. <laughs> I got a package in the mail. And I don't know how... I don't know how <laughs> this this guy is he's a very nice guy by the way, Eric Casey. I don't know how he got an address, but somehow it got sent over to Texas. And then from Texas, three or four weeks later, it finally showed up in Arizona with some mail forwarding. Um anyway, so let's see what this is. Okay, what is this? Chick-fil-A. Well, <laughs> I guess I'm going to finally go to Chick-fil-A. I've never been to a Chick-fil-A before. And I have a hunting beanie so I can blend in. And those, um, <laughs> those, uh, oh, this is actually super cool. I can blend in in those, um, you know, Alabama hunting states. Something looks a little chipped right there. What is that? O-M-E. Oh, home. Whoops. That got broken in transit. We could maybe glue that before. That's actually super cool, man. Thank you for that. Bummer that it got broken. That is super, super useful here. <clears throat> and it looks like there's a carabiner inside, too. I think this is for uh, keep your drink cold. Insulated vacuum steel... Heck yeah. Sweet man. Eric Casey on YouTube. Thanks man. Appreciate it. Holy smokes. A handwritten Christmas card. Look at that. Merry Christmas, Jax Austin. Even drove even drew out a a bus and everything. <clears throat> so anyways, Eric Casey, thank you very much. Um Yeah, please open on camera. You got it, buddy. <laughs> you know, just as things are getting a little cozy in here. Decided to make a uh, last minute decision to continue on. The traffic is a, a, a lot better. Let me just show you. Okay, so that is the accident. It's still here. I'm still at the same spot with all the trucks. This little side road past the dairy. I know, I know it's dark out there. I know. The side road, pa uh, road past the dairy. Uh, is a looking a little bit better and it's just kind of noisy over here. I think I'd rather just be parked out in the middle of nowhere over by Badge uh, on public land, so yeah. That's it, the road.